morning, we're here at the ranch house today. This is a day at the ranch, so we got up this morning. We're getting ourselves ready. We're gonna do a little boat ride to the spring there and get some water. Some fresh drinking water. Mm -hmm. and we come back and we go cook. We got Uncle 12 here with his chaplas there and his big bucket. So we're going on full the barrel. We go right to the spring, load up and come back. Yes. Then we're going to dub a pot. There's some wallaba poos. Gaffer bear fence. And there's the runners. Okay, this is the mighty Demarara River. This is a little below Karkara Creek. And over on the western shore is Christianburg. So we're going down the river to the spring and load up. people 
when it's not hot, they cry for their hot sun. When it rain, they cry oh, too much rain. Eh? Okay, what is the season you cry? Just gotta give thanks, man. But I know that um, the farmers and some people are brave when it's not rain. Look like a landmark, but this the spring landing is, is, is a coconut tree. Is a coconut tree? They see this coconut tree. Just past the coconut tree, right by the Congo palm tree. Are you torn in? Gold Hill Spring, crystal clear water. Oh, well, they cut this, just cut this right here. Wow. Right there. Make a nice entrance. What did you have? Into Jurassic Park. Hidden Spring, someone's still pulling water here too, but it's like somebody's here. But in oh, someone's pulling water. Somebody filling water too. Nice. Left some left in there. Yes. Plenty there, plenty there. Good morning, good morning. Good morning, good morning. Good morning. How are you? Not too bad. You come. You come for some of this crystal clear water, oh, man. Oh, yes, it is here. It is here. <laughs> oh, you just cut the tree and make yeah, it yeah. good. That's, that's nice. Thank you, yeah, thank well, you. Um, I've been getting some complaints, you know, so mm. I said, let's do the thing, because there's everybody coming up full water, nobody in trying to cut the tree, and, mm. yeah. you know, a lot of sound men around the place. I want to be, you know, oh, the guy to well, do it. Or I want to be the one. Yeah, you're the guy to do it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> thank you. Yeah, yeah. I right, take care, man. Yeah, mm, you too. You too. We're gonna go up in here. Can make it up in there, or it's too shallow. No, we can make it. See that guy just take the initiative and make the, the entrance a little easier. A little more accessible. Mm -hmm. Bring it further out. Yeah, yeah. Is something that could still happen. Yeah. That could still happen. You get some some four inch. Yeah. And you have to connect it. Four inch and the next big finish. Yes, it could still happen. We can set that as a, a, one of our projects later then. Yep. Yeah, that's something we could um Possibly. we could think about doing it, yes. So I mean um and I should run the pipe. 
How are you, how are you gonna do it? Yeah. Yes, check this out. This is the spring. So when it's not raining and you need crystal clear drinking water, it's right here. Cool, clear, refreshing. Let me see how you do this connection to help. That's some trick watering pipe. I connect in. Oh, I think to have set up the apparatus. See that? Right next one. Are you ready to go at last? So I've got in another um, park stick here, so a bamboo. Oh, right. I'm going to get the coupling. 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 The last time then we chatted there with something. Yeah, we know a bad problem. Mm. All right, we got a hole. You 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 can have a beer. Ah, good. Make sure it's draining in the boat, then. We have no yet. Why? Why? If you could spin it around to get, yeah, there you go. Nice. Mm -hmm. That's a nice connection here. Coming up? Not yet. Coming? Yeah, it's coming. Yes, coming. It takes too long, man. I better walk to the um, bucket full for that, too. Okay, well, we can switch over to the bucket and fill it because we forgot the coupling, so it's gonna take a little time. It's coming, but it's coming too slow. Yeah. Bring the it's coming at a good rate. Right. It's better now. I can sit down on this spring bike. It's nice and cold, right? Yeah, just sit down here. Cool. So these beautiful palm fronds.
I saw some flowers up here. Fill the bucket. And then we just throw it into the barrel. It's fresh and cold as you can get it, guys. Look at that. Well, if we thaw down here, we ought to get that again. Is it thaw down in the pipe? Yep, slow up. Let's put it on here. Oh, yeah. So we got to spin it over. Yeah, we're going to turn, it, turn our stuff around. We got it better. And the bucket, too. Just trying to figure out the logistics. And we gotta go in. You want to cut glass? Hmm? Oh, you don't want to enter? Yeah, so we're going to see the pot. And I'm going to make a funnel. Are you watching it or snow? Yeah, sorry. <laughs> so these guys turn it around, baby. I like realize the they have more though. ends than for the cigarette. Ready, Freddy? Hey. Can they sit up on the top? Is the yard off? Yeah. I know. Canopy overhead, so it's nice and shaded and cool underneath here. All these palm fronds and stuff, just shaded bamboo and everything. Yeah, yeah, we got fish in here. You have fishes in there? Yeah, it's up in the high water. All oh, the fishes come up in the high water. Oh, look at the tiny little ones, I see them. Mm. In the water, rise, the fishes come up. 
I'm hoping they wash them tight. Mm -hmm. Just a little tedious bending and holding it. That's getting the job done, right? I think I'm too old here. I'm going to walk with a little stool and sit down. Yep. You got ready made a seat right here, though. Mm hmm. All right. While these men working hard pulling, I'm going to enjoy some breakfast. I got a nice little fish ball here. Put the salted fish in the middle of the cassava and fry it up nice. So, a nice sour. I enjoy a good breakfast. This is so good. Delicious guys. But I'm gonna chase it down with some of that nice clear water. Nice and cool. Life in the jungle, a day at the ranch guys. This is what we do. Okay, we finished filling the barrel. We didn't take a, a long time, it was pretty quick. Pretty fast. I can just put that in the guys wrapping up wrapping up production. Yeah, so we're gonna do this, we're gonna get this fixed so that the, whoever comes by boat don't have to um, come out. They can just get it, pull up to the creek and get it. This is the next project we're gonna get look after. Easier. Help out everyone. Easy access. Wanna hold this cutlass? Some of the chaplas. Machete. We call it a cutlass, here's a machete, machete. So we push out uh -oh. the boat. We, uh -oh. I weigh down the boat, you know, guys. Mm. Hello. Big barrel oh, after. I'll come in. The barrel hold, I try to hold the barrel. RJ, balance yourself. Mm -hmm, I got Ready, Kev? Uh -huh. Let me try. Oh, yep, see? Yeah. Two hands. Oh, read me, you know, man. Four hands are better than two. Don't under it, Brian. He had his cassava this morning, so good. We grew up on a stump, this so it was difficult to get off. Just now, just now. Let me pass it. Whoop! Hey, hey, hey! Yeah. Nearly lose it. And then you have to start all over again because the barrel was tilting. Whoop, it's going again. Uh, because we're coming in. Uh, okay. Hold it, hold it. Let me pull out this paddle. Is that on the paddle? Oh, the paddle got it tilted. Go to you. Go to you. Go to you. Go to you. They come crash. Ready? Yeah. Oop, see. Yep. See guys. Oh, you good there? Yeah. Gotta be strong to live the ranch life. You come back in? I want to get in the barrel and take a, a, a soak. Soak, done. Aye. You need to drink this water, you gotta enjoy it because you work hard to get it. Mm hmm. Let me 
have a seat. Have a seat. I'm gonna head out back. Tribilo. Yeah. I didn't balance the baby more open side. Still over there a little bit, isn't it? Yeah, you go. We headed out back to the river. I don't know, the creek because the water went down a little. So we don't want to hit the engine trying to get out here. So we out into the river. He's about to start the engine. Let me see what's going on here. Off that was hanging over so it makes it easier to not hit your head or still going in. And we are headed back up the river guys. So we just got back home. That's where we're setting up. I think he's gonna attach it to the pump and pump it out instead of bucket pulling it out. So, which is easier. He's gonna fill the other barrel there with it. Back in the day. There's a bucket and that was it. Now things are a little easier. This plant has been here for years upon years since I was a little girl. The jasmine plant. The flower smells so sweet. And look at the other jasmine plant. This one was bigger, but now it's came down a little. Yeah. I think it, it got old and they chop it out and it spring back. So this is what it looks like. And a big star apple tree there too. He grew up with that. And the mango tree. This is the primrose tree. This used to be big and we used to have, it had a fork in the middle. We used to play dollhouse in there. And then the hoobity cashew tree. This was a huge tree too, a part of it fell down. Memories, guys. Hi, good. Yeah, man. Yes, we went and got fresh water from the spring. Huh? Okay, mistress. How we do? All right, all right. The neighbors passing in the boat. Benny. Benny Jacobus, mom. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, Benny? Yeah, yeah. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Plum tree. Alright. Mama on her front porch there. This is um thing three one mole, you know. Yes, yeah, so it's setting up the pump there to pump it out.
the sky. You gotta hold the open thing. You reach thing. You gotta get peace more. Reach? Gotta reach. Reach. You got Just gonna bring the barrel forward. I'll go bring the boat forward too. That's our only boat. Wow, look at this beautiful thyme plant. Fresh thick leaf thyme, guys. Yeah, the weary weary pepper, but it's not bearing right now. I think this is the bigger pepper, not the weary weary. We got a little baby yeah. coconut tree here starting to bear fruit. Sugar cane. Okay, so we got this set up here. Oops. Are you breathing yet? Huh? Are you coming? Yeah, he's coming. Come in there, he's coming in. It's coming uphill. Up in a jiffy. There it goes. The barrels fill. And now Brian got some. <laughs> we got some fresh fish at a 12 quart. So we're gonna put it in a curry. Because is Mr. Murray going to do a curry? I'm going to cook a, a Murray curry. This is a tiger fish, 12 cut. So we cut it up. We call it tiger fish, the real name is call it. So we're going to bring this down in a curry. Yes. Yeah. Not the tank. I'm pulling the barrel like this. This is the day on the ranch, guys. That's what we do. You catch it fresh, you cook it, you eat it. Mama enjoying her breakfast. Go ahead, Mom. Well, the guys are at work cooking and fetching water and whatever. Mom on her porch. The breeze nice, eh, Mom? Mm hmm enjoying her nice little egg ball there for breakfast. So he's doing Guyana guys. These men busy pumping water, filling up the tanks, doing all the stuff. Brian in the kitchen cooking the fish curry. Nice relaxing day on the ranch. This view. Beautiful. 
I used to be back home in your old domain, ma'am. <laughs> it's real nice. You just miss it, eh? Miss it in here. I love the heat. I'm missing this heat at all. Pumping up water from the river and pulling another barrel now. So this is to just wash in and stuff. Go down there, Mark. There's the drinking water. This one is for washing and stuff. You got the brine. It's mango tree. Yeah, this is the other black tank. They got this pump and fill this too to flush toilet and using the bathroom and use that at the sink to wash stuff. So, and look, look at this green mango brand got going on here for his. This is the curry boy. Curry. Uh, in the edo, so we're gonna put some alu. Some alu in the pot. I yeah. prefer edo, but. We ain't got the. Yeah, edo. The cashew tree got some now coming up. I know they got some cocoa. Yeah, they got cocos there. Breadfruit tree. Mm -hmm. A lot of fruit trees we got in the back. Breadfruit, bread nut, coconut, sugar cane, sugar cane, a plum tree, plum, cashew, cocoa, grapefruit, star apple, guavas, coconut in the pasture there. Last time we come, they had some um, star apple. Yeah, last time we got star apple. We cook it in the pasture. So we got a lot of stuff. This is where we grew up. This is my dad's place. The whitey look like it's right. We got some whitey hair. Oh, look at the um. Look, mom. This one was waiting for you. And we got, you saw another one? Okay. We got some whitey hair. Oh, they're well ripe. Okay. Oop, oop, oop. I'm dropping everything. It's sweet? Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> Look, this one's soft and sweet. Try that one. Mm -hmm. Nice sedium. That was waiting for you to come taste because the tree ain't really bearing. They got a lot of green ones, but those two ripen just for you. There's bread not coming up there. Mm -hmm. Oh, look nice, right here. The cashew tree. So Jackie said I'm chilling out with uh, brother Mark and say mommy granny yeah drink well in Guyana a beer is a banks. There ain't nothing beating a banks. We give thanks for a bank. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and he just, Danny, Danny just relaxing, feeling happy to be home. And he just had white tea and 
Sedium. Um, um, Sedium. Oh, Terry was asking me what's bearing. I, I said, I don't, I'm not sure. I don't know what's in. Sedium and white tea, so we're relaxing cherry, and catching up on cherry our garden beer. This oh, no, this, this, is, this is where Sherry loves. Like this is the plum rose tree. Oh, when this bearing, it's got more fruit than leaf. This are sorry. Mm -hmm. We're like saying sorry, but ah, uh, Sherry says next sure she can't attack you. Yeah, Sherry likes sorry, bad, bad, and bad. She just taking it out. Yeah. Sherry said it's sorry, sweet. So how <laughs> sorry could be sweet? Why is it with sugar got sweet? No, no but it's just she eating it just like that. Just, she, so. just so she well, eating I it. I think it's by love. No, she likes to eat it Maybe just like that. Not in pepper, nothing, or just so. Yep, it's good to be home relaxing on the ranch, guys. Ranch My life childhood is the home. I'll mm -hmm. pick one of this time leaf for dropping my quarry. You think it's time to put the time? <laughs> not, it's not time yet, but I'm going to. Oh, big leaf time. I'll pick it until the time reach. <laughs> <laughs> This is the man of an alley cock going home, boy. That's Norvin. All right. Going home, catching the tide to go home. All right, them. Them a tree? Yeah. A glimpse of Uncle Boy. Already doing good for his age too, boy. Wow. Look what we have in the pot here. We got some nice parpy going down in the pot. Oh man, I, do, I love those orange skin ones. So we're gonna get that bang out of curry bubbling here. Mmm. Curry smelling plum and beer. Yeah, man. Smell the curry there hitting Granny My Granny come upstairs. She's ready to eat. Yeah, that's curry look good. So, we got the going on here, guys. This on this day on the ranch, we're gonna enjoy so much. We enjoying. And now you don't need to settle in overboard. Yep, gotta go and take a dip. Take a swim in the river. Look at this. This is what daddy used to stamp and brand the cow. This is stamp, the cattle, and this is the horn. But it is blue when they're hunting. Remember we told you guys they used to blow the horn, two for down, three for up, where the deer are going to fall? This is it. Twelve, you got to blow this horn, boy. You got to blow the horn. There was one upon a time. This was Daddy Brown for the cattle. Yep. All the horns hung in here. Food time. Food time. Brian done dub his curry there, so we're gonna dig in and enjoy. Time for the business part. Look at this, guys. Oh my god. Gosh. There's a potato, there's a green mango, and there's a sorry. Mmm. Blimby. Time to take a soak by hit the river. Nice tasty guys, this feels good. 
Sure Dana, so can you hear see girl? I miss your hair. You should have been soaking in your AC. This is good. Mm -hmm. This is the life. Looking in this black water feels so refreshing. Yep. Mm. You know how refreshing this feels? This is a nice cool dung. Yep. How you doing? You feeling the cool water coming out of the creek? Yes. This is good. All right. We're going to enjoy this, guys. There's a turtle. <laughs> Swimming by Jackie. <laughs> From far, it looked like a turtle coming. It's our sour seed. Yep. You know, you know they use this for sores and yeah. it's a poison, but they do use it. You gotta know how to use it. Yeah, if you've got certain kind of itch or sore or fungus. Fung yeah, that kind of thing on your foot is. I could remember Mr. Fit. Just use it. Oh, you got a nice. There's a nice thing. Go again, let me see. Go again, let me see. Yeah. The contractor used to call this, right? I don't get it, God. You, you don't shy the dog. <laughs> Black <Blackout purple. laughs> You got a couple, you got a couple. Mm -hmm. Let me see how the arrows are seed go. Oh, <laughs> it's light. I used to do, we used to do this as children and I used to get a lot, but now I get out of practice. Let me see this one. You know the chop chop, you use a boss open and get the seed and, and use the offer for the skid from the water tap, man. Mm. Yes. Mm -hmm. When you take out the seed, you bust the seed in half, too. Ooh, this feels good. Yeah, this one. And when you want it, you don't get to. Yeah, you can use it. <laughs> Yesterday, when we were driving in the river, I see a stinker toe floated down. Ah, you don't get it? I, when when I realized that we don't, don't pass, I said, oh shoot, there's a locust. I think it too. Guys, them tree over there where this drops from. Mm. Oh, that's how I see ice cream. Crack and eat. Sometimes get a fresh one, sometimes get a stink one. They would go down. Hey, do you have one with the parapet though? Yeah, you put this. You, you turn it off? I forget everything with the parapet. This is laundry, you see? They are the ranch, you come down and you get the laundry. <laughs> There's some um, jamun on the tree. Mark, I'm trying to shut it down too. Let's see, climb up. Oh, there ah, you nice got, you got, you got. Yeah, you got. Let's see. Well, this one it's getting, getting hit. It, it's getting overripe on this branch. Yeah. Right? Them woman, you got it too. Mm, they overripe. Like the there's a sun. Let's get them like this. <laughs> Oopsie, one fell. I guess they, they're not fully ripe, mm. that's why they're falling. This is, this is what it looks like. Jamun. This makes the best wine. You get you get a wine made from jamun, 
Got to make it good, dude. Some people make it too floppy. Got to make it good. Nice. Go jamu. Look at what it looks like inside. There's the seed. And the flesh. So. It's good. Mm How -hmm. oh, we talking business? When they fall overboard, the cut back and the eat them. Mm -hmm. Looks like a grape. Like grape. I'll wash them. Can I climb there? We should have picked some as we come when the water was, the tide was higher. I got one. I think it's small one. Nice. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm going to eat the tamu. So it's good for diabetics to lower their blood sugar. So when they eat it, it helps to lower your blood sugar. So this is very good for diabetics. And it has a lot of vitamins and minerals for the body. So this is the parapy. We boil it, now we're gonna eat it. This is the big one, this is the small one, all from the same bunch. Some people peel the skin and eat it, but you can eat it with the skin. Nice. This is real nice, like this. Chain the river accent for two. You snooze, you lose. This is how it looks when you peel the big one. So the big one carries seed. In the seed, there's a nut. A hard, hard jelly nut, a dry coconut. I'm gonna carry a couple for Jackie. Jackie saying, please bring two for me. You tell me? I, I eat two so far. Peel it or you could eat the skin, it doesn't matter. But mm -hmm. Feeding the fish right now. Give them the skin that they enjoy it. Um, real nice, real, real good. Mm. Real nice. Mm. And if the alley catch it fresh. Mm. I say you were the hustle for fence in the tree too. <laughs> so this is a, a type of um, palm. It's a palm. Fruit. Fruit too. And these, these one have the nuts in yeah, them. Yeah, I was explaining that just now. Mm -hmm. The small ones don't have the nuts, but the big ones do. And they grow in the same bunch. No. <laughs> oh, it's so good. Mm -hmm. This is the last. Yeah. Oh, River girl. Mm -hmm. River girl. <laughs> What's up, Benny? Bye. Yeah, I got insurance. You'd have be low insurance mark there, you know. <laughs> overload, overload. Oh, oh y'all do. Yeah, good afternoon. You got good stocks there, boy. The real thing. <laughs> All right.
Look guys, I just found the ite. This is how you peel it. So the ite is... Another, another palm. Different type of palm fruit. <laughs> exactly, and it grows so much here along the river mm -hmm. and creeks and... So, so this much. you can... Um, and the wild cows love this. You can eat this. The tapir, or we call it, we call it the wild cow. The tapir love, love mm -hmm. this. So you can scrape the flesh and eat it, or you can um, make a drink with it. Del Tiri, um, powerful drink. This one is a little hard still, but it's good. See the bottom here, nice and see it peeling nice, eh? Easy. Oh. Mark, did the, the, the fish eat this though? Mm -hmm. yeah. okay. Tibi Kori love Tibi -kori. it. Mm -hmm. So I, I never fish with this, I fish with Kori. Mm. Mm. Rupert was a Katabak fisherman. Mm -hmm. Guys, man, I grew up eating all these things. We had a big eater tree right here. Right there, right where the stump with the grass. Yeah. Oh, right, yeah, right here. Right where the grass. And, and this was a hubadi tree, right? Yeah. Right there. Mm -hmm. I did it's, talk it's about one tree. in the video the other day that we used to find this and bury it in the sand. Right yes, you did, you did, you did say that. I switched the ripen and, and then we eat off. it. Mm -hmm. As if somebody creased you and see when you bury it and go that, uh, jump, <laughs> dig it up before you. We used to tie it in back and hide it between them roots there. Mm -hmm. So it will make it between the sand and the, the water that when it comes up and soak it, uh, uh, both of them get it soft. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. This is the nut. This is the nut from the parpy seed. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like a um, coconut when it's getting dry, but it's sweeter. Yeah. It's like a dried coconut. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But very sweet. With my own. Sweet. Yeah, man. Yeah. This is what I was talking about, chop chop. Mark just find it. So you burst it open. This one got two. Sometimes it's got one. one. Mm. So you burst this in half now, the seed. And you skate it. And uh -huh. this, this is skating nice in the water. Top. I'll try one. Okay, we just skate the whole thing. See? <laughs> See that? Oh, you could catch it back. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Chop chop. We oh. should just bust it like this and escape. Mm. Ooh, See? that's a nice one. <laughs> the whole one escape like. Mm. Dogs, they want, dogs want to take it on, Mark. Oh, you found this one? Sands and jack them the pump. I dissolve and swim in it. You think it's from too close? Yeah, you're going to do it right. Oh, you got it this one far. 